the question is a mistake for Andy Reid to play Mahomes Sunday night. The mistake, the question should be mistake if he doesn't. <laughs> where, where is Whitlock's cell phone, man? man. Let's, let's see who texted him, man. Yeah. <laughs> what that came out of Kansas City? You know he used to work there, right? Yeah. <laughs> Only time you root like this is when some money about to get put down. No. And I hope not. I hope not no because money on this game. it will be a mistake yeah. to play Patrick Mahomes, but it's not a mistake to prepare Patrick Mahomes to play. Let's talk about the shift in philosophy in terms of conditioning and preparation that occurred in the NFL. It's happening with the New Orleans Saints and Drew Brees and Teddy Bridgewater. We were like, you going to rush Drew Brees back when you got a bye week coming up after this? You know why? Because there used to be a, a mindset in the NFL that once we played our game on Sunday, Monday was just to come in and watch film. Don't do anything. Tuesday, you're off. Wednesday, show up. And you know what used to happen on Wednesdays we show up? We look like RoboCop because we're all stiff. We haven't done anything in 48 hours physically. Then they shifted. Monday, I need you to jog around, light conditioning, lift a little weights, and watch that same film. You know why? Because there's a difference between a cool-down effect and then just putting yourself on ice. So if Patrick Mahomes can move in a protected space, you prepare him mentally and physically as if he's going to play. But then you pull off in those moments, let Matt Moore go out there. So I think they're just trying to keep him warm, keep the valves moving, keep everything going fluid in a way that he's mentally engaged, but physically, you won't see him Sunday. I, I think it's dangerous when it gets out and gets reported that a guy is back ahead of schedule because it does play to what you're talking about. Get him on the field, get him working Get them, get them getting a feel for what it is that it is to work on that knee healing up. And for it to get out that he's ahead of schedule, that's great that he's ahead of schedule. schedule. Well, I don't know. I, usually the, the people who reported Patrick get it Patrick Mahomes wanted to play uh, 10 days ago. And that's fair, but he dislocated his, his I knee. I still want to play too. Right. I, I just, <laughs> it's dangerous. It's dangerous when those things start to get reported because then now the narrative becomes the pressure for him to play versus the pressure for him to stay and get healthy and, and get healthy Andy within the right Reed amount of time. Man. He wanted to play Andy Reid held him I, out. See, I don't know if it's held out versus he needed to be out. Let me ask you this, Whit. Let me ask you this. If, if they go into the game and he plays, and he gets hurt, was it a mistake? Mm -hmm. Can happen at any time. That's true, but but we yeah. know that he's coming off you of could a fall dislocated off that knee. chair right now. It definitely could end in an injury, right? Yeah. <laughs> but the reality of it to me, oh, here we go. But the, the thing about it is, is that when you're talking about a guy who represents the, the future of your organization, why would you risk that for one game? I agree. I mean, Why would you risk it? You think, go back, RG3. Remember, he came back. Mm. RG3 got hurt. And tore it yeah. all the way up. And died on the right. field. Yeah. Kevin Durant, literally. Sport basketball. Yeah. Shouldn't have been playing. Came back too early. And, I mean, look, like injured. you said, you can get prepared to play, but he's not ready to play. You know, they always say. How do you know that? I guarantee he's not ready to play. A dislocated knee? I mean, the mother was saying, they what? popped it back in, and the man was walking around perfectly hey, man, fine. Hey, you're walking around with, you know, walking around mm -hmm. and running around with guys chasing you. Look, Mahomes is, he's at his best, and he can run and throw that ball, you know, throw the ball on the run. He won't be able to, he will almost be like a sitting duck. And yeah. if I'm a defensive player, I'm like, oh, cool. You can't run? I'm going to really tee off on you. It's, it's a long football season. This is their franchise quarterback. Why are you going to? You're going to jeopardize him for one football game? It's not even the playoffs. And, and right. people it's, always it's, focus in on the injury and not the compensation that occurs when you don't come back fully recovered. That's so it. So then the, the opposite hip, the opposite leg is taking too much stress, and all of a sudden you mess something else up over there. Pop and an it, Achilles it, tendon. It, it, anything can happen, and that's how it goes. It's the cumulative effect. I see your phone. Yeah, it's oh, been good. You've been texting with Pat Mahomes. Oh, 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 look, look, look. Now you're going to switch it. You're going to switch it up. No, we need to see your phone. We need to see what's going on in your hey, phone. Anybody more injury prone up here? Raise your hand than me. I mean, I know I'm, everything broke on me. And it's because, in part, you feel that pressure of, I can't, I, gotta let get my, back. I can't let my, my guys God, down. I got to I got to stay in this. I'm an MVP candidate. They, they need me. Man, they need you most when you're at your Best. Best. Don't do anything if, else. Now, if you're on a sorry football team, a real, like, like one in six, or only, you're like, hey, man, I ain't, I ain't trying to get back out there right now. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> it's like, you know, when you get beat, you look at that clock, man, we still got a whole other quarter of this, boy. Time. It's cold out here. We getting beat up on. <laughs> man, 
He you didn't. played on a turf toe for an entire season, 2, running 000. the ball. Yes. 2,000 yards. Yes. Ran for 2,000 yeah. yards. I, you know, they I, popped the man's kneecap back in. He looked perfectly fine to me. Look. He thinks he's perfectly fine. They're letting him practice. If you can practice on Wednesday, you can tell me you can't. Whitlock is instigated. Hold on. You know, he's probably not there. You know, Whitlock be like, hey, you ought to be glad you got a job. You know, NFL gave y'all a job. Y'all happy? You know, Whitlock. You ain't feeling that, man. You ain't feeling that. You ain't feeling that. Wait, wait, think about toe was falling off. They put it back on. That's quarterback. This is your future. For Ain't one no game, way. think of this is your future. No way. The future of the of the franchise. Hey, hey, look, this is no joke. All right. I'm not, I'm not joking. I, <laughs> this is no joke. The man wanted to play last Thursday, back going to go back into the game. Wasn't it Denver on yeah, Thursday? Yeah, Denver. Mm -hmm. On the third. He wanted to go back in the game. He looked perfectly fine. Looked. He's now practicing on a Wednesday. And and this is the thing that that you all don't get because you're not you didn't spend any time in Kansas City. My mother moved to Kansas City in 1984. That's when my association with Kansas City started. We haven't been to a Super Bowl since 1970. Mm. We have a kid that can get us there. And Andy Reid hasn't been to a Super Bowl once, but has, hasn't won one. Andy Reid knows the stakes here better than any of us here. So we're going he to trade knows, we're gonna He we're knows the information. In. If Andy Reid is willing to consider it, okay. why shouldn't y'all? I got to trade game. in the possibilities to, yeah. of the franchise for one game. an amount of time nah, for, for one season. And, and, and even using, look, I know you're pulling at the heartstrings now, telling us about 1984. She brought little baby Whitlock <laughs> out to KC. <laughs> All that sounds amazing, but... You've never won a Super Bowl, right? Yeah. So you can't miss what you never had, right? So, therefore, I need you to just push pause and allow this to run its course before you go out there, rush it, and blow it all you up. You did put it on personal. You, yeah, you yeah, did put it on personal. How do y'all know more than Andy Reid? We don't need to know more, more than, than Andy Reid. You know, but you know one thing is mm -hmm. people forget? Them pros on that other side of the ball, too. They ain't, they, if, his, if his knee hurting, we go, they gonna tee off on him. Oh, he went, he wearing a red place. jersey in practice. This is practice. Wait till the, re you know how it is. That's when how it got the real bullet stuff. Hey, we're locked. It's for real. The ankle and this the knee. It's for hurt. real. Here's some else. evidence. Now, we've been working together for a year, so I remember, let's go NBA Finals, Kevin Durant. I, didn't I say Durant? And you were very critical of them putting Durant back there in harm's way, and that's the finals. And you want Patrick Mahomes to go back out there? Regularly? Didn't Durant have surgery? Yeah, after, after, after. Not then. After. after. He, he's going to need surgery after. After he you blew put, it out. Especially if you put him out there this week. <laughs> the floor is yours, Will I? It's a different floor. <laughs> uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a, it's a different floor. Oh, and then, oh this is oh, worse. You have, need a different floor. This in is football, worse. football, yes. you have to play sometimes hurt, hurt. with pain. Mm -hmm. You don't play injured. Yeah. The man is not injured. How you know? He's, and and the other thing is, he can protect because Andy Reid says. So. Oh, well, he can God, protect man. himself. <laughs> he feels it. He can he can get rid of the ball quick like oh. Tom Brady. They can they can do an offense that provides him protection. <laughs> He's in shotgun. They're not gonna run no quarterback sneaks. They're playing Green Bay. They can't win. They have to win this game. You know the Colts. And the Houston Texans have little <laughs> young black boy. Nineteen eighty four. I'm telling you, man. There's look, they, can, they, they can't even run the football. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know Damian black. Williams' longest run ten yards. And if you don't have Mahomes out there backing the safeties <laughs> off. They're not gonna run the ball. You think they're gonna run it with Matt hey, Moore? Mahomes can't run, so how, what, you can really hurt. You can really get it's him the hurt. Year you can't to protect him. This, was, this was it's not an year. expert se segment. This was a fan <laughs> segment. Yeah, this let's, is all. Personal. Let's be clear. This was a fan segment. Yeah, who's, who, you who, know who's more the than fan? Andy Reid? No. No. Yes, in this case. Andy Reid doesn't know more than me. He's a Thank Hall you. of Famer. Yeah. He can get away with yeah, that. I ain't yes, I do. I ain't going down that road. Thanks for watching. Subscribe here to get the latest from the show and be sure to check out more of the best clips from Speak For Yourself or go watch a few segments from our other shows on FS1.